Sagittarius, hello. It's your girl from Amethyst Rose to Row coming through to give you guys an energy check-in. All right, so this will be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node, okay? Please take what resonates and leave the rest. Every message in this reading will not be for you, Sagittarius. It is collective, okay? All right, so we're going to do um, a reading for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. We're going to get a spellcasting oracle, an Isis oracle, um, and then we're going to get into the tarot. I did want to show you the bracelets, the signature Amethyst Rose bracelets. I made them myself. If you are interested in buying a crystal bracelet from me, um, just send me an email. Let me know if you like one. Um, they are 12 bucks each. They consist of rose quartz, amethyst, clear quartz, and black obsidian. Okay. All right. So just let me know if that's something that you'd be interested in receiving a charged crystal bracelet. All right. Um, and you can just shoot me an email, okay, if you're interested in that. We're going to hop right into it. This is for Sagittarius. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Guides. This message is for Sagittarius. What is Sagittarius? You need to know at this time. Archangel Michael, please protect me as I channel the messages for Sagittarius. Please block any interference that stops their message from coming through. Please and thank you. I Want You Around by Snow Allegra off the album of Those Feels Again is on. It's the message for Sagittarius. Sagittarius, the moon rising in the north node. wanted to flip. I'm going to let it flip out. Y'all know how I am. I hate pulling cards. I hate choosing one. Thank you. Passion. Writing your element. Okay. With travel. Okay then. Let's see. Sagittarius. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Ancestor, Spirit, guys. I said we are for Sagittarius, so I'm arriving in the North Node. What's the message today? Whoa, Divine Sun Child. High Priestess, somebody got both of these today. Mysteries revealed in the eyes of Isis. Okay. A lot of orange and red in your cards. Okay. Um, let's get into the message. Somebody is a high priestess here. I forgot who got that card at this point. I believe Aries. I believe. Yeah, I believe Aries got this card. All right, let's see what's up. Sagittarius, what's the message? What's the message for Sag? What do they need to know at this time? Okay. Okay, so somebody's waiting. What you waiting on? <laughs> Let's see. You waiting on something. Somebody could be looking at where they want to go next. Maybe you travel a lot or something like that. Queen of Cups. Somebody could have water highly aspected. Somebody could have something to do with the Scorpio Pisces or a Cancer. It has something to do with uh, the mother of someone's child. What's this? Four of Cups. Okay, so somebody's feeling down and out right now. What's this? Left out is what I'm hearing. So what exactly are you doing, Sagittarius? You got the High Priestess here with the King of Wands. 
So maybe somebody is dealing with an Aries. What's this? The Hierophant? Okay. Hmm. What's this? Three of Swords. Okay, so somebody could be feeling heartbroken. They're emotional. They're sad. Somebody's sad. Ace of Cups. Yeah, somebody is overly emotional. Somebody could be crying. Got the Two of Cups. What is this? Is somebody having like a destination wedding or something? What's this? Sagittarius moon rising. Uh, -uh that's way too many. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Knight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Page of Swords, and I guess I'll put this one on this side. Queen of Wands. Um. So is it, okay. So it was a third party situation, and somebody is little feeling left out here. Is what this is giving me. Somebody feels unseen. Somebody isn't interested in somebody. Um, whoever this is, somebody could find you very attractive, Sagittarius. Yeah, this Taurus maybe. Um, I mean, I'm just going to say it because it's right here, but somebody could be spying on you or, um, somebody could, somebody could see something. I don't know if somebody is inquiring or, um, looking up something or looking into you. Um, th th somebody is trying to look into you. It could be through tarot. It could be with the actual psychic. Um, but this could be, um, just a, a Pisces that's kind of spying on you and, um, just trying to see something here. I don't know what they want to see. Um, they could just want to know how you do something or something like that. Yeah, but it looks like, it looks like somebody is getting married here as well. And somebody else is, um, uh, sad, whoever this this third party is or maybe somebody is getting divorced here maybe um um there could be somebody that's yeah that somebody is definitely going into contract or under contract with somebody else that's what this is giving me it's kind of like a whole bunch of just you got the high priestess and the hierophant here those two people are merging together that leaves somebody out in the cold okay i mean that's a simple way to put it Somebody, they love somebody else or somebody met somebody new or they could have met them online. I'm not sure. Or at school. Um, but yeah, somebody finds somebody very attractive here. Okay. Let's see. The High Priestess. This is for Sagittarius. What is this? temperance that's you all right and then you got the knight of pentacles so something something could have been slow to move here can i get another one ace of cups yeah um this gives me self-love um sagittarius um or people could just love what you do um if you do do something like um a earth angel or you give light to others um, love and light to others. You know, it's looking like people may love you. Um, now, there is something. There's somebody watching you. Okay? What's the Hierophant? The Hierophant. Somebody finds you very attractive. Sagittarius again. So, Sagittarius, are you linking up with the Sagittarius? But whatever this is, you may be just... It could be an Aquarius or a Libra here coming in. Um, it looks like you're going to have like a faded meeting. Yeah. Closer to me by her. Yeah, this is what this is. This looks like you may meet somebody by chance. Somebody who's very attractive. It could be another Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. But yeah, whoever this is is coming in. I mean, we do have the, the Queen of Wands to the King of Wands here. 
So somebody's baby mother could be who's or this water sign could be feeling some kind of way. Yeah, you got new love here. Something is going to be very passionate. Yeah, you're starting something new here. Beautiful energy. Okay, can I get one for the Ace of Cups? Strength card. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so uh, could be a Leo. Or you could have ended something with the Leo. Something uh, stopped here. This could be somebody that's crying over you. Somebody has two children here. Okay, uh, what's this? What's the, what's the Ace of Cups? Why is the string card here? Sagittarius? Sagittarius? What's the Ace of Cups in the string card? What is this? Somebody's missing somebody. Ace of Ace of Cups. What is this? Uh uh now. All right. Ace of Cups for Sagittarius. The Devil card. Somebody could have Capricorn Holly aspect. Did something happen in the past though? So this could be somebody that's overly emotional that watches you or something like that it's like somebody this is giving me the energy of somebody trying to hold back tears though because you have a couple out here or two people that may be together you match each other's energy the high priestess to the higher fan the king of wands to the queen of wands but somebody else, okay, so, okay. Somebody could be wanting somebody to stay around for the kids or something like that. So that's why this person is sad. Who is this Queen of Cups? You got the Ace of Pentacles. With the Sun, with the Hierophant. With the lovers, what in the world? So, Sagittarius, what I'm getting is this is how somebody can view you. But something could have come to light here. Or there could be a lot of money going to it, to this or going to be going to this um, Queen of Cups. Somebody could be putting somebody on papers here. So it gives me a situation of where somebody gets with somebody else or, or and they reject whoever this person is. So this person wants to, um, can I get another one for the Queen of Cups and the Ace, Two of Cups. With the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck, with the tower, is this a Scorpio here? Um, mm. <sighs> somebody could still be so Sagittarius what I'm trying to figure out because this is a third party situation here for some of you some of you do have new love coming in but for somebody else is um is them the uh, per their person and the mother of their of the person's child here but somebody is obsessed with somebody else they want to hold on to whoever this person is so i don't know how easy it's going to be for this person to release whoever this is because it's really <laughs> I feel like somebody is able to kind of pawn the kids or something like that or and I hate to sound that way because you know
Queen of Wands. This other person could be a Sagittarius. Queen of Wands. Like somebody's baby mother could be a Sag. Queen of Wands. What is this? What's the Queen of Wands? Four of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles with the Queen of Wands and the World card. Yeah, something is over with you, Sag. Are you you or, or it's time for you to pull the plug on something? Because somebody is juggling you. Somebody is cheating here. You could know this. I mean, I don't know. Can I get another one for the Hierophant? Why is the Wheel of Fortune here with the Hierophant? Judgment. Yeah, somebody is about to get karma. And a lot of it. Um, Somebody could be communicating a decision to you. Uh, somebody could want to reconcile here, um, Sagittarius. Yeah, somebody wants to take you out here. Somebody, it's it's like it's 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 a lot of moving parts and whatever this is. Um, if you're single, you know you're single. Of course, yes, you have new love coming in. You have a lot coming in. Your ships are coming in. Um, on one of those ships is a partnership for you. Okay. Um, now there is somebody here though. You could have water highly aspected yourself, Sagittarius. You know. Um, place the puzzle pieces where they go. Um, somebody does find you very attractive. They want a partnership with you. They see you as a gift. All right. Now somebody is getting karma, and it's looking like it's gonna be this Taurus right here. There's a there's a Taurus getting karma in regards to you. Or here we go. Um, if you are a cross watcher, and you know somebody's baby mother is a Sagittarius. This and you dealt your person is a Taurus. This person is getting hell and high water, hot water or whatever, um, with their baby mother. Okay, they had a partnership with you. You were the gift, but they went back. They wanted to play. They wanted to go sleep with their baby mother. They wanted to go be attached or something like that. They fell for the waterworks, all this kind of stuff. But they're getting karma at this time because this person is under judgment. Somebody went crying, whoa, 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 I want my family back. Come on, let's make it work again. Don't look like it is working out too well if you deal with a Taurus. Okay, I can't even remember what Taurus's reading was about. Um, but somebody did something strictly out of passion here. They didn't do it for the stability of a thing. Um, because over here with the Queen of Wands, I see the Ten of Pentacles with you. Okay, somebody has the gift of foresight here. Somebody is very gifted, Sagittarius, and that's you. And it looks like you already knew what this was going to be. So this could be you missing this person, Sagittarius, but if you're missing them, or they could be missing you, but just know that whatever this rendezvous is or, or whatever, um, it looks like they did it out of love for the child or the children, and not the actual person. Okay. Um, but let's read the divine sun child. And see what's going on there. Yeah so don't worry about whatever this is. Yeah you got ace of cups. You got new love coming in. Good karma. Yes. Don't worry about it. This person is under judgment. And they're going to wish they had held on to you. Alright. Let's see. Divine soul child. This is for Sag. Let's see, 50, number five, okay. Weak, yeah, this person was weak. Weak by SWV, <laughs> off the album, it's about time. Yeah, whatever this is, yeah, that's what this is. The new love that's coming in for you is going to be very abundant, okay? It's going to be a partnership, very emotional, very passionate. You guys definitely match each other's energy. Yeah, like I say, you got counterparts out here, Queen of Wands, King of Wands, High Priestess, Hierophant, somebody just matches your fly, Sagittarius. They just match your fly. Yes. All right. So, Divine Soul Child, Blessings of the Sun Falcon. Blessings of the Sun Falcon, the Divine Sun Child, Horus, 
son of Isis and Osiris, flow to you now, beloved initiate. It is time to allow your life to flourish without limits, to let your light burn bright and without veil, just like the midsummer sun burning without contest in the Egyptian desert. Blessings of the sun falcon herald the time when your divine legacy is being born. It is your time, your time to burn bright. Yes, and that's what this is. Something that you do is your passion. This could be, listen, this is dope because if you read tarot, this masculine does too. <laughs> like, it's, this is really dope, man. Like, seriously. Now, if somebody, you know, hey, they're going to be sad and crying out in Memphis night, but not you. This, this, you're going to have every reason to be happy. All right. Well, all right, Sagittarius, that is your reading. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you need personal information is below. Bye.